Hello and welcome to today's demo. Today I'm going to talk about real-time speech-to-text and translation using Azure Cognitive Services. Uh, for this demo, I have built a single-page uh, application that have uh, uh, several uh, features. The first one is uh, that you, you can act, you can host uh, a session. So imagine that you you are presenting in a conference and you have uh, you would likely have uh, folks in the audience that are not comfortable with uh, the language that you're speaking in that they would like to have it translated into their own language or maybe they're not hearing you uh, well enough uh, so uh, you can host a session and it will uh, capture your speech to text in real time and at the same time other people can join a session and follow it in their uh, favorite language. Um, we also have another feature uh, for transcripting audio files. Um, a common use scenario would be that, um, let's say that you have um, conducted an interview and then uh, you have recorded it and then you need to transcript it. Uh, so in this service here, you could just upload this audio file and, uh, and the application will transcript it for you. And then also you have the option to save your uh, transcripts. Um, all right, so let's start with this first demo here. So I'm going to host a session and uh, we're going to do this in uh, English. I have prepared a small YouTube clip that I'm going to play. And at the same time, I'm going to open an additional browser window so that we can see that uh, the speech to text is being broadcast to other browsers as well. So uh, let's go ahead and click start and see what happens. So as I'm talking here, you can see that uh, it is being outputted uh, on the screen live. And I'm also going to play this YouTube video now. On. In long thought, that there are objects out in space moving around between stars, and sometimes they can pass through our solar system. And not long ago, something from deep space made a surprise visit. Some say this visitor was a comet, or maybe an asteroid, but another astronomer strongly believes it's something completely different. Was it the splintered remains of an exoplanet? Or was this interstellar visitor some kind of alien spacecraft in disguise? All right, let's click stop here. And uh, as you can see, here is my full transcript and uh, I have an option to save it. So I'm going to save this one, my first uh, presentation. And it's being saved. And at the same time, you saw that uh, it was live translated to Swedish uh, in this browser. All right, the next use case is to transcript an audio file. So what I'm going to do here is that I'm going to drop this file here. And I know it's in English, so I'll keep it on English here. And then I'm going to click Start. And I've also uh, implemented a debug console so that you can see in live here what's actually happening using the Azure Cognitive Services Speech SDK. All right, so you can either stop it whenever you want to, or you can let it finish uh, once it has gone through the whole uh, recording. Uh, but I'm not going to wait for that. So let's say that we want to stop it now. Same here, uh, I can go ahead and save this one. Let's call it Batman. For these transcripts, uh, I'm using uh, Azure Table Storage uh, to save them. Um, and then we can go inside to view transcripts. And as you can see here, Batman was uh, the latest one here that we used uh, or when we did the upload uh, demo. But we also have this other transcript uh, for the hosting 
uh, session. But if we click on this one here, we have the full transcript here. We can also um, export it as PDF if we would like to. And we can also have it played using text to voice. Let's take an accent here, maybe Hindi female, and let's see what happens if we click on play. Skills and abilities. Batman has no inherent superpowers. He relies on his own scientific knowledge, detective skills and athletic prowess. In the stories, Batman is regarded as one of the world's greatest detective, if not the world's great. Right. Um, yeah, so this was uh, the demo. And uh, if we're going to talk about uh, the various technologies here being used, um, we have the client side application and we have the, and it's built in Vue.js, uh, which is a reactive uh, JavaScript framework similar to React uh, or Angular. Um, and uh, we also have the Azure Cognitive uh, Speech SDK. So the speech to text uh, is processed uh, in the client browser. And then we also have Azure Function for, for example, uh, um, getting saved transcripts from Azure Table Storage and also saving them. And we're also using Signal Air service, which is a real-time broadcast messaging services in Azure uh, that we, we're using uh, a publish and subscribe method. Um, so basically what happens here is that uh, the text when you're hosting a session is broadcasted to Signal Air via an Azure function. And then we have uh, subscribers that are fetching these messages in real time using uh, web sockets on the other side here. Um, yeah, so these are the services being used. And now I was running my demo locally, but ideally I would uh, host this uh, application using Azure App Services. So we have the application here. And we have my Azure functions here, which I'm serving locally now and uh, just for uh, when I'm developing, but then I have the option to um, deploy it. All right, so that was uh, the demo for, yeah. And this is uh, the front end application that we have. Uh, it's written in JavaScript. Uh, and then we have the Azure function here, where all the functions are defined here. If you have any questions, uh, do let me know. Thank you.